Pokémon 2, czyli to już nas odcinek trzeci. W dzisiejszym odcinku trochę polatamy po mieście i zobaczymy zresztą. Czekajcie chwilę, muszę coś jeszcze sprawdzić i zaczynamy. Dobra, sprawdziłem wszystko, więc możemy zaczynać. Sorry za te hałasy z mikrofonem. Time for old Spidey to go clubbing. Residents thanked Spider-Man for cleaning up their community, calling him, quote, one of us. criminals apprehended by Spider-Man turned out to be wanted on far more serious charges. can get a picture of her data. this info.
never get to sightsee. to get a shot of Detective DeWolf's evidence. Suitable for framing. He's a heck of a cop. I can use this info. This gang war is a crisis, but it's also an opportunity. People get careless when they're backed into a corner, and these guys are so focused on fighting each other, they're taking chances they wouldn't normally dream of. I think we can use this chaos to catch organized crime figures off guard and shut them down for good. Hammerhead. Used to be a soldier for the mob. Dumb muscle. Leg breaker. But then, he survived a near-fatal head injury. He had most of his skull replaced with metal, and the rest of his body augmented with cybernetics. I've seen him run headfirst into a brick wall and smash it to pieces. Wrap a machine gun into a pretzel. He's also hard-headed in the sense that he's stubborn. And that's how we'll get him. My life is so weird. Jonah Jameson who I really am just to see the look on his face. get a shot of Detective DeWolf's evidence. <laughs> Great composition. She's a heck of a cop. James D. Wolf. Hammerhead likes to dress and act like a 1920s gangster. Pinstripe suit, Tommy gun, the whole bit. He also uses their methods. Cement shoes, gunning down enemies in the streets, and keeping his business records in old school ledgers. But we've come a long way since Prohibition. If we can catch him, I can put him away like his hero Al Capone. On tax evasion charges. Dobra, komentujcie, subskrybujcie, do zobaczenia w następnym odcinku. Na razie, cześć.